This is Black Rats Podcast reporting to you live with a number. Yeah, you already know what it is, man. We got some legendary people in the building. And today, who may I be speaking with? Rap a lot. Rap a lot. Rap a lot. Most definitely, I ain't even gonna lie to you, man. If you wanna get your locks right, you gonna go to Rap a lot. You know what I'm saying? What inspired y'all to open up this brand, though? They say that necessity is the mother of invention, and that is true in our case. Uh, it was out of a need that I invented rap a lock I've been locked since 1998, and when I began to wear my locks, there were no styling uh, options. Okay. We okay. just wore our locks the way Mother Nature styled them. And that was all good, and that was beautiful. But I had another vision. I had a vision that I wanted my locks to be curly, and right. spirally, and pretty. Yeah. And so I invented a product that gives me that look. Yeah, you most definitely dragging on them, though, love. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> what was some of the processes that you had to go through? Was it something that just happened overnight or through a lot of trial and error? Uh, well, the first process is that I had to believe that I had something that was different and unique and that I was willing to put the work in to bring it to the masses. Right. So that's what I did. I decided I wanted to take it to the masses and I had to get in and do the work. Yep. Uh, and as one of her kids, <laughs> she had us in the back by the laundry room, like a sweatshop, <laughs> making rap a lot. So I done seen it from that stage to this stage. There you go. And one thing I want to say about locks anyway, you had a you had a, a whole culture of people that try to ban it, try to shame it, and y'all owning it and making styles out of it though. Right. Like how proud is that seeing your vision being manifested in to life. It's awesome because when we tell our own story and our own history or her story, then we will always get to the truth and the beauty and the love of self. Yes, ma'am. And we wanted to celebrate the energy spirals in the universe curls because our hair as an antenna it picks up electromagnetic waves from the atmosphere. That's why it coils and power in it. So we have to realize the power within ourselves. And the universe says, if you go by somebody else's beauty standard, then I may not recognize you. Most definitely. If you are yourself and promote yourself, then it's time for you to go forward and up. Most definitely. And I see y'all not only standing behind it, but y'all bringing that family element as well on that as well. I'm proud to have my sons, my wife. We got my oldest son here, my middle son, and actually he made the commercial for us and helped with our content. That's what I'm talking about. Content. So that's a wonderful spark to help things flow. And uh, we're learning, all of us throughout the process, to make ourselves better so also we can make a better product for our, uh, our customers. Most so definitely. we're just folks and we love our folks and uh, we want our people to look good. Most definitely, as y'all should, because y'all doing the goddamn going thing yourselves. Look at smoother than seal skin. I'm loving the uniforms, man. Loving the brands. That's the name. Of so y'all sell these as well? We can. <laughs> no, for real though. Oh God, cause like, man, y'all really doing what y'all doing out here for real, for real. But if y'all can get a people like a, a, a level of advice or some games dealing with the hair, dealing with the lots that they might don't know, what would that be? My thing would be to look in the mirror and tell yourself, I love what I see. Thanks. Not what others see in me, but what I see in me. I love what I see. Once you start loving yourself, everything else flows. Quick question though, what was that moment in your life? You know what I'm saying, that pivoting moment, where you just say, you know what, man, it's all on me. Like I love myself, from the inner of my life to the bottom of the soles of my feet. Like I'm in love with that shit. Even if you had a long toe, a small toe, whatever, you <laughs> fell in love. Like what was that moment? That moment was when I locked my hair in 1998. And I really, honestly, I looked in the mirror one day and my hair was just all over my head. And for months I had been trying to tame it to make it lay down and look a certain way. And that morning I just said, you know what? I love the way my hair looked. And I just embraced it where it was. I didn't try to smooth it down, push it back. I just walked forward with it and I was so happy that day when I looked right. in the mirror and I really saw that it was okay just to let it do what it do and quit trying to control it. Thanks though, most definitely, man. I ain't even gonna lie to y'all, man. I got a bald head right now, <laughs> but I wish I had some goddamn gonna lie because I need a rap a lot right now, though. Yeah, and you know, and you know what they say? You know what they say, though? Should I tell them? Tell them. 
You ain't really tapped in till you wrapped in. Well, oh, guess what? <laughs> like you said, do we sell the shirts? We also have other products we sell, and you got a beard coming up behind that camera. Yes, oh, no, that no. smile. And look, it's all herbal, it's fresh and clean, and it uh, tantalizes your body. Thanks. That's why we want to use what's natural because we're we want to not only push this as a product but as a lifestyle. Thanks, a healthy lifestyle. Thanks. So y'all going all natural with it as well, like as you said though, right? Yes, sir. Yes, right. Sir. Most definitely, man. I ain't gonna lie, man. Y'all most definitely standing on high principles, man. How can people follow y'all, support y'all, buy into y'all brands, get wrapped up with rap a lot? Check us out me? at www.wrapaloc.com. Wrapalock.com. Or you can also check us out at Wrapalock Hair. W-R-A-P-A-H-A-I-R on Instagram. Wrapalock Hair. Wrapalock the dual hair styling tool on Facebook. Wrap a lock on Twitter. Just wrap a lock and you got us. Most definitely. Google it, baby. Google you already know what it is, man. Yeah. This Black Grass Podcast reporting to you live with some legendary people, man. You better wrap a lot on God. Yes, and we yes. gone.